Redneck Wise here, doing maple syrup, tapping trees here. Got our drill bit. I like to use these kind because then they don't hurt the tree. Uh, go about an inch and a half into the tree. So we're gonna take the drill, put it on a slight angle. Just drill it out. You want the angle to be downhill. Then when you put the uh, tap in, some tap. All these taps are two dollars a piece. Yeah. All right. Put this in the tree. You want so this part here is flush with the tree. Little notch part. And then that other notch part right there, right there is to hang the bag on. Then we're going to hang a bag on. Got these homemade bag holders here. Get circled in so I can go on it. And then it just drips into the bag, fills it up. Like this. Sack goes in the bag, fills it up, collect it, boil it up. There we go. And then this ribbon is just to mark if it's a maple tree or not. You just tap this tree here and it's, uh, it's dripping pretty heavily. Look at that. Nice and sweet sap. It's gonna be awesome boiling all this stuff down. Redneck wise back here, you got maple syrup. Collect out collecting the sap. So Sunday. So we have 716th tap, I believe, here. You can see today it's not dripping very good, really slow. I'm gonna show you emptying. There we go, it just dripped emptying these blue bags. This little hanger. I'm gonna show you guys what it looks like after we do that. So I'm just gonna empty it into the bucket like that. You see, sap tastes just like water with a bit of syrup in it. But putting these together is really easy. You got a little ring. You wrap that around. Slide it in there before you go out into the woods. Pull it down. Make sure the hole's open. Put it back on there. There's a little hole there. Put that right on there. And you're done. And the steel part is reusable each year. Redneck wise back here. Evaporating some maple sap. Got the tote over there. Going into the evaporator. collected March 20th yesterday, Saturday. Got about, I don't know, how much did we get? 200 gallons, 250 gallons. Uh, We lost about 80, maybe 90 gallons of sap due to a uh, beaver to the hole in our hose that we used to pump it to the collection with. So we're gonna boil this a little bit down and we'll have about of syrup we'll have, I don't know, maybe eight, nine gallons, maybe. Yeah. But we're hoping to get another run midweek, Tuesday, Wednesday, to collect. Then I'm hoping next Saturday. I don't know if that's going to happen, but I sure hope it does. We need to get some sap. You can see this front one. We've had it going for about, I don't know, 45, 30 minutes. I don't know. Uh, it's starting to, you can see a lot of steam it's starting to boil. Back pan here. That's where the fire is under the first pan. Second pan here. Getting, getting there. So we're still gonna keep boiling it down. We got the, you can see the smoke stack up there. It's smoke coming out up top. That is not steam. What we do have coming off these pans, as you can see up in the front pan, up here, what we do have is steam. You can see all this here coming off here. That's hot, that is not smoke, that is steam from the water evaporating out of the sap. If you don't know what maple syrup is, uh, how it's made, what you do is you collect the... Uh, you don't have any sap sitting around, do you? Yeah, somewhere here in the back pan. Yeah, we have it right here. Um, what it is, is it's just like water. It tastes like it's just, you add a little bit of sugar to water, technically like. Um, so what you're doing in the process is, this is just like water, I said, so it's really thin. You have to take this right here, you can see it's just, just like water. It's getting hot now. Um, 
that will turn, will boil that down so that the water will boil out. When you boil water for long enough, the water evaporates. That's what we're doing right now. That's what's called evaporating. You're evaporating the water to make more sugar content, which makes the maple syrup thicker. As you'll see in the next video, this will be getting thicker. Thank you. I think that's just about right, right there, for syrup. Take off some more then.